True that. Stay away, please. The good thing is that the Cowlex won't walk off any uh, platforms by themselves. That's why you use um, the flame to kill them up smaller ledges like this. Because using the charge might send them flying in horrible, horrible directions. Comments on Steve Evans just showed up. All I had to write it in the chat. He said, Brunating oh my man, word. Cyprus and Spyro 2. Thanks to everybody down at ESA for the speedrunning glory. Is 10 bucks enough for Dragon Source? I think, uh, uh, 20. It was 20 for that, apparently. Uh, I, I oh! Yeah, you oh yeah. We met it already. So Skill points, maybe? Well, it's I. SSBM <laughs> stuff. <laughs> A, a bit too late for that. I guess I can go back for them. If. Well, I can if people really want me to. Oh, yeah, I can. I can change my color, like, right now. Uh, I've lost my pizza box. I don't know the shapes ones. Get in. Thank you, SSBM stuff. <laughs> well, was that team who, who donated? Yeah. Oh, cheers, SSBM. <laughs> oh, and uh, yeah, thank you too, Robo, for uh, making me have to do extra work. <laughs> That cannonball took a bit longer to hit the door because I wasn't looking at it. Like I said, what you don't look at, it doesn't happen.
Ay. <laughs> this guy like lines up perfectly for you. For that door. Always a nice thing. What's my time, Dexter? Uh, can someone tell me my time? Thank you. Everything misbehaves in his boss. Yes! That's double up, right? Do it now. Uh, let me get this double hit. Okay. What's like? Nope. There you go, SSBM. Your your uh, yellow fetish is satisfied. Double hits can be pretty awkward in this boss fight. Um, the most easy way to get them is to uh, pick up a missile and uh, find a way to use some of the other, uh, like a bomb or something. So often when I try to do it, I like to wait a little while to see if a missile comes out. I'm not supposed to like this. This is going to be a pretty nice goal. Yeah, I think the scope was better than my 100% PV. That's very, very good. It was good. Nope. <laughs> One last. You've chosen wisely. I bet it quit. 
I like how the orb still <laughs> right there. Sorry. This level does not require any um, any special route, you just follow the route that the level already gives you and you get a skill point still. <coughs> For some of that tunnel, flying is actually faster than charging. For some reason when you uh, are getting the blue rings you get crazy speed with flying. Talk to me. Uh, never mind. <laughs> oh, okay, Spider. Here's what you've got to do. I've got the plane on remote control. This is just so my least favorite orb in the game. Targets with your machine gun. Press circle to fire the gun and use the deep battle analog stick to aim. This is Crash's least uh, favorite orb as well, because uh, he's not too consistent with this orb. And I have not practiced uh, this orb, so I don't know how it's gon going to go. Hopefully it will go okay, as always. Okay. So I have to go back to Fracture Hills and Shady Oasis for the orbs that require head bash. You cannot even start the uh, orbs if you do not have head bash. Okay, Robo, this is what I do, and that's all the supercharged gems. I did that in my fourth year. What? Was what was that? <laughs> so weird. Yeah. 
Yes. Just keep those earth shapers away yes. from me and I'll take this At uh, 2.15.40 something. Pushing those guys out of the way uh, creates a safe path for the alchemist for the rest of the challenge. Meaning I can go around this area and get the gems here as he's finishing his walk over the hunter. For some reason, Hunter is like uh, pinkish brown in this level. Pro probably because it's supposed to be dark, but yeah, it doesn't really look right. Wait, ah, this guy first, then him. We make I thought I wasn't going to make that the challenge. The challenge is quite tight with the enemies. Hi. Just winter tundra left now. Mm -hmm. Can you, can you tell me my time, Nev? Uh, 156.40. Thank you. What time are you looking 
people here? Uh, sub 220. I'm hoping for. Yeah, so. I mean entering into Tantra again. Oh. Uh, I'm not sure actually. I forgot what times are good, what times are bad. <laughs> well, it's freaking one gem. So I have about 20 minutes to finish this home world if I want to get a new PB slash world record. Probably won't happen, but you can always hope. Oh yes, about that. <laughs> well, there goes the world record, I guess. The latest was um, SSPM stuff uh, for the. Uh, yeah, he donated for Dragon Shores. So that's what I was saying. I don't think so. Aww. Don't talk to me, please. The Druzman was supposed to happen. Uh, can you do it? Yeah. Um. So basically, suppose. what's meant to happen here is. Um, there's meant to be loads of guys running around who are on fire and you're supposed to use a power up that you get from defeating enough enemies to freeze them so you can ring those bells um, however by using the combination of uh, double jumping and the rocks, um, oh no. the rocks you can skip that entirely so they don't appear I don't need this rock, I've got the bash. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks. That's the idea. The flaming guys is like um boundary, I guess, is still there. But the flaming guys are not quite loaded. Oh wait, I'm supposed to go here. Uh too late. Spike. Yeah, I was supposed Contact to. Contact for that 63-year-old one. <laughs> yeah. Yes. And uh, 9,980 gems. <laughs> Any gems around here? No. I. I was sick. I'm gonna attempt unattempted strats here. This is tricky. I just want something to be picky about um. Uh am I gonna make it? Come on! Yes! I'm gonna try and get the two baskets on the right hand side of the building. Okay, there we go. <laughs> what? How are you able to follow me?
This level has the worst enemies in, in the entire game. It's great how those elephant guys, they always have a hitbox underneath their feet, like a damage box underneath their feet. So if you jump up from a platform which is slightly underneath them, then you'll still get squashed. <laughs> Pausing and unpausing skips the cutscene with the uh, thing flying up in the air. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Weird strats for getting this jar because Cypress has something uh, in Sparrow's mouth, so he can't flame it like you would normally do. So you have to charge the jar. Ah, great, no sparks. Luckily, there's a frog here, and it happens to give me an extra life. I think so, I'm not sure. I don't... I'd assume it's 10. There we go. Jesus.
No! Oh. <laughs> that I just... seemed really delayed reaction. <laughs> it was. There we go. Now which one is Winter Tundra? For those of you who are just joining us, this is uh, ESA 2012, the European Speedsters Gathering, coming to you live from Skövde, Sweden, hosted by Ludendi. We are uh, gathering money for the charity Hand in Hand, which is a member of a group of independent organizations who are working towards a shared goal, a uh, shared vision to eliminate poverty through income generation and job creation, mainly in third world countries. So all the money you donate will... 100% of that money goes to that charity. We are currently at... Let me update here. I think we are just above... Yes, we are currently at... $1,550.28 of our new goal, $2,000. So keep those generous donations coming in. We all love you. You are currently watching uh, Cyprus. Right? Yeah, Cyprus playing uh, a 100% run of uh, Spire. Of uh, Spire 2. Coming up after that, we have uh, races. It's uh, Fresaman versus Irregular Ginny in first Mega Man X and then Mega Man X2. And uh, following that, the schedule is in complete disarray, so we're not sure ourselves. But uh, stay tuned, and we will give we will be sure to give you all the games you want to watch here. At least the ones that are on the schedule. So, thank you. And of course, we are currently one ten dollar donation away from Fresaman doing the Mega Man X race block shirtless. And we might try to convince uh, Jin to take his shirt off too. We'll see. Let's face it, you know, we need to raise this money. <laughs> if you want, you can 
counter donates if it doesn't happen, but you know. <laughs> Maybe 10 to 15 minutes. We've got Dragon Shores, don't we? Yeah, Robo donated. Yeah, Robo donated, yeah. Damn it, man. It's gonna be a bit longer because we have Dragon Shores to do after this. Oh, yeah. I can we uh, have a split when I beat Ripto? Sorry? A split for finishing? Yeah, just yeah for beating yeah. Ripto. for that very useful information. I I don't know where all the UFOs are the first time around. Where is he? There he is. Excellent. The UFOs are positioned depending on when you get here. At least the first UFOs are, the second uh, UFOs are always in a set position.
think one five gym fell down where the elevator is, which happens once in a blue moon. And I was right. I am missing gems. <laughs> Shoutouts to Buff Siegel, aka Excellent. Magnus Jacobson. these gems. If you press all of the uh, shoulder buttons, uh, Sparks tells you where the gems are just by pointing at them. It's like that one ability in Spyro 3, except you don't have to unlock it here. There! Ah, <sighs> nice. Nearly there. Crickets, that's kind of poor. Red orbs all around. I hit him, please. One hit. I always have so much trouble with the red orbs. Has he even dropped one other color yet? Uh, he dropped he a green. green yeah. Oh. Red. Red. Oh. Yes. Yay. You can get five hits uh, with the green power up. And only four with the blue and red. Unless you're like pass, then you can get five hits with blue. Blue is the most, I think it's the strongest. Yeah, that's the most damage. This happens way too often. Orbs get underneath gulp. One hit? Are you serious? Ah, yes. Okay. Get ready to uh, split. Get ready to time.
Ah, oh, Mr. Uh... You, you can get. We can get. You, you can get four hits early. Uh, on this stage of the boss, but I only got three. Ah. Sub 230. Yeah, that's very good. <laughs> Considering the current SDA run is 250 something. Yeah, about 250.